John Lippman murder, lost his wife in the two weeks ago. The minute she was gone, you'd started. And within a week, you pushed me to breaking point. You've let me down. And that is the worst thing. Because I didn't think you would do that, either of you. Yes. Lord, look, my daughter is sat right here in front of me. So if it was Peter. Listen, I don't have the time nor the patience to deal with this sort of thing right now. So if you want to make a private appointment, I suggest you ring my office. What? Sophie, what time do you call this, hey? Sophie! Sophie! But if you want to be a man, this is not the way to do it. If you want to be a man, you have to stand by your family, me and your sister, and face up to what's asked of you. Peter, if not for me, then for your mother. It's what she would have wanted. And that means not staying out till late, not throwing your education away, and not setting a general bad example to your sister. Now I know you are not a coward, so please stop behaving like one and start communicating with me. I've done nothing wrong. And if you'd stop and look for one second, you'd see. But all you ever see is the bad. Please, Dad. Look around you. Peter, you didn't come home last night. After everything I've said, where have you been? I don't know. That's it. Hello, Sophie. Sit down. Sit down. Sophie, where has my little girl gone, hmm? Because she was here not that long ago. I know it's hard. 